You know, if it seems like we talk about staying cool and staying hydrated a lot, you're absolutely right. We do talk about that. And we're going to talk about it some more, at least until the weather finally breaks and uh, we can have temperatures under 100 degrees. So the last week or so, um, we've logged at least three different occasions where some of our coworkers have needed evaluation by paramedics because of heat-related illness. Now, that's, you know, three instances in the last five days. And, you know, obviously that's far too many. You know, zero is the right number. But, you know, sometimes this heat catches up with you, and I understand that, and I appreciate that. So, as we've said before, we have a, we have a duty to each other to watch after each other and make sure that so long as you're okay is part of it, but the people around you too, make sure they're okay too. Um, sometimes they may not have a great realization that they are starting to succumb to heat-related illness. Um, confusion is something that comes with it. So it's important that you uh, watch each other as well as watch out for yourself. And everything like we've said before, make sure you're well nourished, well rested, stay cool, get cool when you can. You know, if you've got a long sitter, take a couple of minutes in the middle uh, between an offload and an onload and just get yourself cooled off for a minute. Get some cold water in you, get a couple of electrolytes if that's what you need, but take the time that you need to get cool. Um, along those lines, um, a lot of people may not have a, have a good realization that UDO has some cooling towels available. With these things down, they stay wet a little longer than uh, some other cloth towels, but those are available in UDO. If you haven't already picked one up, go grab you a cool towel. And, you know, give yourself a chance to, to beat some of this heat because it is absolutely miserable out there. And, uh, you know, be careful. As a matter of fact, I was just thinking about this. I saw a video about a UPS driver collapsed on, collapsed on somebody's front step yesterday in Scottsdale. You know, his job is as strenuous as ours. His job is as hot as ours, and that could be any of us. He didn't have anybody watching out for him. We at least have each other be able to watch out for each other. So please watch out for each other. Uh, questions, comments, do hunt in the comments section or hit us up on the hotline. And in the meantime, uh, be safe. See you next time. Thanks.